MGK had a better diss. Encore was better than Relapse. Revival's better than Kamikaze. Tom McDonald clears Eminem in all categories because he speaks on the important things. Bro. I made this post asking you guys to send me your most controversial takes about Eminem. We're gonna be walking through it. I'll let you know if I agree. And yeah, let's get started. Worst hip hop fan base. I see why you think that, to be honest. Sometimes I get harassed in the comments. Let me put some comments out. Like, bro, no normal person says this. Till I Collapse is an overrated song. I love that song. What? I kind of want to listen back to it because I don't even know what you're talking about. I love Till I Collapse. Takes like this would be easier to understand if you just explained it. Like, it's overrated song because I don't like the hook or something. But yeah, I don't really know what's wrong with Till I Collapse. Machine Gun Kelly had a better diss track. That is crazy. Okay, first off, I'm going to say no. I disagree. I think Eminem bodied him and there's a reason that MGK looks like this now. <laughs> However, I listened back to the MGK diss track. It wasn't that bad. He did pretty good on it. I think the music video honestly made it worse because if you just listen to it, it's good. Music video is kind of corny. But yeah, it's not as bad as people act like it was. Eminem destroyed him though. Let's be real. He did not have a better diss track. Music to be murdered by is better than recovery. Right off the bat, I disagree. It might be the nostalgia because I grew up with recovery. Maybe the songwriting on music to be murdered by is better, like lyrics wise and flow wise, but recovery feels a lot more. And like Eminem really cares more, to be honest with you. Some of the newer music, it just feels like he's rapping just to rap, but recovery, he was coming off that addiction. The change from relapse to recovery was amazing. We watched him evolve. So I gotta go with recovery. And then he also said MMLP2 is a top three Eminem album. That's just wrong. You have like Relapse, Marshall Mathers LP1, which is definitely better. The Eminem show, you have recovery. Some people say Kamikaze. That's not to say MMLP2 is a bad album. I think his catalog is just so like stack with a collection of music that good. It's just hard to put MMLP2 over all those albums for me. Eminem's comeback trilogy. So Relapse, Recovery, and MMLP2 is better than his classic trilogy. Now this is interesting because Depending on what style of rap you like, you could completely agree with this. I agree in a songwriting sense, so if you're talking about like flows, maybe how fast you're rapping, rhyme schemes, then you might like the comeback trilogy. He seems a lot more vulnerable on like relapse recovery. Honestly, all three of those, he's a lot more vulnerable and more mature. So if you like that conscious rap, you probably like that newer Eminem. But if you're like me and you like the comedic side of him, like the Slim Shady LP, some of those songs off Marshall Mathers LP where he's just being funny over classic boom bat beats he's got some like troll songs just trolling the media basically trying to make him mad that's why people like the original i could agree with this though in some senses so. i also think the comeback trilogy wouldn't have happened if it wasn't for the original obviously like he had to make those first i think they really impacted his career and that's what made him kind of switch to that more mature side so it's hard to pick one over the other for me at least but yeah good take role model is his best song and relapse is his best album okay so we'll go one at a time role model it's an amazing song. I love the guitar. I love the drums to it. It's pretty iconic. It's been sampled a lot with those new Doomsday. I've heard it in a couple other songs actually being sampled as well. Role Model's great. I could see why you argue it to be his best song. So yeah, good take there. Relapse might be his best album. I completely agree. I mean, he really gets in that persona of a serial killer. He's like making full storytelling songs like he does with As The World Turns in the Slim Shady LP. It's like he took that style, put that right into Relapse as a murder story. And it fit perfectly. I think he did amazing on Relapse. Very underrated. It gets a lot of hate. There's songs like My Mom and Insane that are just instant skips. But besides those, I mean, I could see why it's his best album. Good take there too. Infinite is dope. I don't think that's really a controversial take because I love Infinite. Actually, on second thought, I've had a lot of comments of people hating on Infinite. I don't really know why. I love the jazz production. Love the rhyme scheme. It feels very vulnerable and like young Eminem really wants it. So I love Infinite. Mockingbird is overrated. Oh, I don't even want to read the rest of this. Mockingbird is overrated. I really think people only like it due to it being emotional. I mean, it's an emotional song, so yeah. But there are better emotional Eminem songs like Say Goodbye to Hollywood, When I'm Gone, Like Toy Soldiers, so I don't get the hype. I mean, he can have multiple good songs that are emotional. Saying people only like it due to it being emotional, it's a little interesting because it's an emotional song. I don't know what else you'd really like for it besides it being vulnerable. But you can say that you have other favorite emotional songs without saying Mockingbird's overrated. I think it lives up to the hype that it gets. Encore was better than Relapse. I completely disagree. I was just fighting for Relapse as his best album. Definitely a little biased there because I think it's one of his best, but Encore just has some of the lowest lows of Eminem. It's hard to... If you average out Encore for its highs, like Yellow Brick Road, amazing song, with its lows like Puke, Rain Man, My First Single, it just like weighs the whole track list down to me. I can't really excuse Encore. However, I was thinking about it the other day. 
if we get an encore too, I would be very happy. I want to hear the song Bully on streaming platforms as soon as possible. MMLP1 and the Eminem Show are the best rap albums of all time, definitely. But the fact that he said definitely makes me feel like I'm not changing his mind at all. But I don't think I really need to. I mean, for me, I have them both in top 10. I wouldn't say they're the best, just because like Illmatic, Enter the Wu-Tang, there's some big albums that made a huge impact and they inspired Eminem to make those. So it's hard to put those Eminem albums above what inspired him. But I have them both in top 10, amazing albums. The takes I've seen on here are actually diabolical. His songs with Rihanna weren't that good. That is interesting, because they are some of his biggest songs. They were all over the radio for a while. This guy said his verses are weak, in my opinion. You guys seem kind of split on that in the replies, so let me know what you guys think on that take down below. But I don't really have anything to complain about him. What would you change? I mean, he, this guy said the verses are weak. I don't really know how. It's never stood out for being weak to me, at least. I think they were pretty good. The Eminem show is the best album, and nobody can change my mind. Good take. I don't think I need to change your mind. Like I said, I prefer Relapse, but the Eminem show is amazing. In my opinion, I feel like Relapse was his top three albums. Thank you. Along with Marshall Mathers LP and the Eminem show. Yep, good. I don't know why it gets so much hate, to be honest. Yeah, it does get hate, but it is what it is. I kind of hate it on Encore for having low lows. Relapse also has low lows, so a lot of Eminem albums just have some troll songs on it. It is what it is. Eminem is still very good, but if he just shaves that beard, he will be back in his prime. I don't know if that's how that works, but sure tom mcdonald clears eminem in all categories he speaks on the important things i just lost motivation to film right now no i'm just kidding i think this dude is trolling because i saw a couple replies that he made on another video and he was just hating on people so <laughs> revival is better than kamikaze as albums no but if you look at like the highs versus the lows songs like castle and rose walk on water very emotional I'd say they're better than the highs on Kamikaze, but the lows on Revival are way lower than the lows on Kamikaze, if that makes sense. Well, that is it for this Hot Takes video. If you want me to make a part two, let me know down below. Let me know what I should react to for Eminem. I've been making tier lists, brackets, all that. I have a playlist right, yeah, right up here of all my Eminem videos. So you can click that if you want to watch more. If you have more Hot Takes, drop them down below in case I do make a part two. Thank you for watching. Peace out.